I ain't losing my focus. I was going through pain, but I'm making it go. All these wounds on my body, I'ma cover and close. Like it's snow on the bluff, we just keeping it rolling. Everybody wanna know how I'm keeping it going. I don't think it is harder to know. I've been putting my vision in work. What's up, gang, man? We tuning back in, y'all, with another vlog today. Y'all can tell, man, I'm all at the crib all by myself. It's so quiet here, bro. And this shit, like, it feel kind of weird, bro, because I'm always used to hearing somebody coming downstairs. I'm just always used to hearing people in the crib, but y'all know the gang went to Atlanta and stuff. I stayed back this time. Uh, J Lone stayed back and Amar stayed back, y'all. So uh, right now, uh, I know Amar had hit me earlier, asked me what I was doing. So y'all know, as y'all can see right now, bro, I'm I'm hit. You feel me? I gotta go get a chop. I'm about to go get a chop in a little bit. Or well, before that, I'm about to go get some food, man. I'm about to go get some torchy tacos. My stomach started growling and stuff, man. So I'm like, man, I'm hungry. I'm about to go get some food. So after that, y'all, I don't know what else I'm gonna do today. You feel me? We gonna we gonna dive into something, but we have to dive into something. I'm, I'm trying to see, man. I'm bored, bro, because the whole gang left. You feel me? So, all I know is that I'm about to go get a haircut, y'all, and get some food. And after that, I'm I'm gonna find something to do. You feel me? Like I did just say, Amar did hit me, asked me what I was on. So I'm probably hit, bro. Was locked in, see what he doing. You know, probably link up and stuff. But man, bro, the house feel weird, y'all. The house feel weird, bro. When it's just so quiet, I'm probably gonna mess around and go to my apartment or something and, and chill out. You know, show some love to my apartment. Every time I think about. Every time I think about paying that rent over there, I'm like, man, I'm not even over there enough. So I need to go over there and chill, up, chill over there for a little bit. But yeah, man, woke up this morning, y'all. Hit some push-ups, hopped in the shower, changed. I got some cool stuff on, man. Got the Balenci shirt with some with some shorts on right now. These type of, sh with these type of shorts, you know, I'm going to put my black Balenci shoes on. And yeah, man, I'm really just in here vibing, chilling right now. I'm trying to see what I'm getting into today. Like I said, man, the whole gang is gone, bro. So I'm trying to see what I'm going to do, man. They're going to be gone from the 2nd to the 5th. So I think they're gonna come back like some Monday or something like that, y'all. So yeah, man, I'm gonna go get some food and everything. Whenever I do that and I get a chop, man, I'm gonna tune back into y'all. And we gonna, we gonna do something today, y'all. So just stay tuned. We is on the way to go get some tacos right now, bro, from Torchy Tacos. And bro, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I can't wait to do some tunes to her, bro. You know, some exhaust, you know, muscle delete, add some horsepower, all type of stuff, y'all. I really can't wait. But we gonna take our time, bro. Yeah, baby, we gonna take our time because that's one thing I had to tell myself. I had to let, tell myself that like, I can't rush everything, you feel me? I got a lot of stuff going on, you feel me, y'all? Like, my apartment, get my apartment, my whole apartment together. I had to buy all my furniture. When we moved into the FOE house, you feel me, y'all? I had to buy all my furniture and stuff, uh, from dresses to beds to everything, you know? Like, everybody else already had they, uh, they beds and they really, they furniture, all they had to do was really move it, you feel me? I'm the one that had really had to buy everything y'all you know and get everything all at once so uh i'm not gonna rush everything you feel me i'm not the type of nigga like i'm not the type of nigga to get every uh to get stuff and, and be like okay i gotta get it done right now like don't get me don't get me wrong i be wanting to do that you feel me who who would want to get everything done in one day a lot of stuff is coming i can't wait to tune in and everything and take it to so i don't know if i'm gonna be racing and shit you feel me y'all i ain't that type to want to go to car meets and race for bread and stuff you know that really all that shit really don't excite me. I just really want my shit fat to be fast and want my shit to be loud, y'all. But I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I'm really trying to see what I'm gonna do today, bro. Like it feels like different. The whole gang is gone, bro. Like the whole gang is gone. So I'm trying to see what I'm gonna do. I know I look kind of rough right now, y'all, bro. I don't, I started breaking down some more stuff, so that's another reason why I got my jug of water because I noticed that like I ain't gonna my body was feeling dehydrated and stuff, and I know my body. So basically, like, when I started going to the gym and stuff, I started sweating all that alcohol and all that stuff out of my body, all the, the bad foods I've been eating and all the, like, the bad shit I've been drinking and stuff, and I started sweating all that shit out. So that's why my face started breaking out and shit, y'all. So I've been drinking a lot of water, and my face started getting uh, better. So hopefully my shit gonna really clear up in a couple of days, hopefully, y'all. But I, like I was saying, I know I look kind of rough right now, but, man, I'm gonna shake back in a little bit, y'all, because, man, your boy gonna go get the chop and everything. And I'm really trying to see what to do, man, for real, for real. I'm gonna give me some food, man. Cause I really don't want to sit in the house all day, y'all. I really don't. So, man, yeah, bro, I'm gonna get some food and everything. I'm really gonna probably tune back in with y'all after I get my chop, man, because I'm tired of being on camera looking like this. But I had to tune in with y'all, man, let y'all know. Uh, Yeah, man, just let y'all know what I'm doing, man, and what the vibe is like, y'all. So just stay tuned. I swear, y'all, everybody want a V8 until it's time to put gas into it, bro. I swear to y'all, man. I didn't, you know how many times I didn't put gas into this car already, y'all? Like, I ain't gonna lie. I forgot having a V8 come with all this shit, bro. I swear, y'all. This is like my, I can't, I swear I'm not over-exaggerating. The other day, y'all, the other day in total, 
I put $50 in this thing in one day. And then the next day I had to fill it up all over again. But that's because I've been road running. You know, you y'all y'all know how it be when you first get a car. You feel me? When you first get your, your car, you, your baby, you feel me? You gotta you gotta put her on the road, you know? So man, I ain't gonna lie, like I'm 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 coming to the gas station every day, y'all. I swear. I, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I forgot about this part of having the V8. See when I had that Benz, I was in that V6 Benz, I put $20 in that $20, $25 in that thing. I'll be good for the next three days. Especially, especially even if I'm on the highway going a distance, you feel me? It's, it's just a V6. This is a, a way bigger motor, way bigger, a way bigger engine, y'all. So it's uh it's gonna eat gas a lot faster. But man, as y'all can see, you feel me? I put a cooler 25 in there, man. I'm just trying to get to Amar real quick, y'all. Because he's at this spot. He's waiting on me right now. We is back in action. And as y'all can tell, man, y'all can probably tell by my energy and some more shit, man. But your boy is back in action, man. My boy Mo got me right. He had to get me right, man, with the chopper. My bad, y'all, earlier in the vlog. If my energy was just like a little low, like my energy was probably a little low because, you know, I was fresh off of wood. You feel me, y'all? I was fresh off of wood. And then I ain't had no chop either, bro. You feel me? But y'all know, man, when you get that chop, you feel me? You feel like a whole different person. You feel like a new man. But I'm on the way right now to go uh, to meet Amar. He had this little uh, gas convention, you know, uh, get this gas convention. I think they got some Zod and everything up there. I don't know. I'm really about to go see. I don't, I don't know nothing about what's going on for real. And all I know is after that, we're going to go to the mall. We got to go to the Gallo. Um, and then after that, we got to go get some, we're going to go get some food from my bro C. Woods. But I haven't been to a restaurant before, but I've seen Amar post it. It looked good, it looked nice and stuff. So y'all, we're about to go get some food and stuff later like that. But um, yeah, <coughs> Amar told me he was gonna go to the mall. And I was like, yeah, I need to go to the mall so I can look at some shoes and stuff for Kenzie. You know, and I know y'all probably been wondering about Kenzie, where she been, have I seen her and all that stuff. Yes, bro, I've seen my baby. I've seen her multiple times. I haven't put her on camera yet, y'all, because like, you feel me? I don't, I don't, I'm not about to just pop up in her face with just a camera in her face, you feel me? Like, it's, some some stuff you gotta leave off camera some stuff you you can put on camera you know um, i'm definitely gonna show her uh, show y'all her again you know because i know y'all y'all want to see her y'all want to see how she's doing y'all want to keep up with her and there's nothing wrong with that but it just certain sometimes it just certain times for it just certain times for certain stuff it's times for certain stuff you feel me y'all my bad bro y'all know i can't talk for shit i'm always stumbling over my words and i wonder if they got something in real life to where like you can go to classes to to <clears throat> fix your speech i think they do because like i got like a heavy tongue bro and i be tripping over my words like i don't be stuttering y'all but i don't be i be tripping over my words and i don't like that especially when i be on camera and shit y'all so my bad y'all yeah but y'all already know y'all already know i can't talk for shit but yeah man um i've been doing a, a whole lot better y'all from the simple fact that i've been seeing baby kinsley and i've been seeing her a lot especially this past week and everything and uh yeah bro like I said, I am going to put her on the vlog very, very soon. But I, I didn't want to just go over there my first couple times seeing her and put the camera all in her face. No, man, I want to just soak up all that time uh, and just see my baby hug her. You know, because <clears throat> y'all know I went like a, a month without seeing her, man. That was hurting me. But when I went over there for my first time, my first time wasn't just yesterday. You feel me? I, I, I just told y'all, like, I just seen her. I seen her multiple times. But, you know, when I went over there and stuff like that, it's like she remembered me. You know, it's not it's not like nothing changed for real and all that. So that was a, that was a really good thing, man, because that was one thing I was just scared about. I was just scared, like, you know, like, I hope she don't have to just get used to me and all that good shit again. But, man, <laughs> at the end of the day, me and Sierra is good, bro. We both understand that we made a mistake, even letting it get to the Internet. We, you feel me? We're not even – I'm not pointing no finger. She's not even pointing no finger. We made a mistake, you know, and we human, y'all. And we we know what come with this. We know what come with putting our our life on the internet, being YouTubers, um, having y'all involved about what's going on. It's pros and cons to it, you feel me? It's positive stuff that comes from it. I feel like it's positive stuff that comes from it because I actually learned, be learning from the shit that y'all be telling me about being a whole father and about like just watching over Kinsley and stuff. And the bad thing about it is when you put your business on the internet, you always gonna have people thinking they know this, thinking they know that, and then you just gonna always gonna have some some negative people to have something negative to say, you know. But at the end of the day, y'all, me and Sierra is good, bro. And I'm just trying to be the best father I can be. I'm trying to be the. Uh, I know she's trying to be the best mother she can be. And at the end of the day, I want to help her as much as I can. 
you know, in any area that I can help in, you feel me? Like, mentally, physically, financially, you feel me? I just want her to be the best mother she can be. That's it, y'all. I just want her to be the best mother she can be. Y'all know I can get the yapping and I can get, just keep talking all day long about this, but uh, yeah, man, at the end of the day, my mental was at a way better space than it was. I was really going through it that, that, that past month whenever I wasn't seeing her and stuff was rocky. Because at the end of the day, whenever I lay my head down, bro, if whenever I lay my head down at the end of the day, bro, and I'm not right with my daughter or my, my, my child's mother, you feel me? Like, I don't like that. It really does something to me, you know? But at the end of the day, y'all, my bad. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to keep going on about it. At the end of the day, bro, we good. We talked about it. Uh, we chopped it up. We good, man. So, you know, later down the line, y'all might see us do a little co-parenting vlog. Because, like, we have a whole child together. This is my job. You know, this is my life. And she does the same thing. So, um, I'm pretty sure in the future, y'all are going to see us in a vlog or something together. You know, we're not forcing it. I'm not asking her to do a video. She's not asking me to do a video. Ain't nothing like that, y'all. We just... I, we just want to be good parents at the end of the day but hey man i'm glad i'm glad that we got to this point like i said i'm on the way to Mar right now y'all then uh, we're gonna hit the gallo i gotta look at some shoes and stuff for my baby you know and um yeah bro you know i can i can just keep on going 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 on about it y'all but man i'm really gonna just tune in with y'all back when i tune back in with y'all when i get to Mar. hey look at this shit y'all what, what y'all think about uh amar y'all think his shit can keep up with mine i don't think so Hey, but my shit fully stocked though right now, y'all. My shit fully stocked. But more, I don't know if he got some shit done in his shit, y'all. I don't know. But as y'all can see, man, we is at the mall right now, man. I came because I gotta get baby Kenzie some shoes or something, man. You feel me? Amar told me to get out the house, so I popped out the house. I wasn't even gonna do nothing today, y'all. But he told me to come, so I'm here, man. So yeah, we gonna get baby Kenzie some stuff, y'all. And we just gonna see. We gonna keep it popping and rolling. But as y'all can see, Amar right up there. He just vibing. Mars just be walking and vibing, y'all. Look at him. <laughs> Me and the Mars on the hunt right now. I'm trying to find baby Kinsley some shoes. And then we going to the Webster. Bro, I want some, what you said? You wanted some Marnie slides? Yeah, man, I want some Marnie slides. Yeah, <laughs> my nigga needs some Marnie slides, y'all. I, I already got some gray Marnie slides. I really want like, Hey, yeah, bro. Hey, I swear. Hey, I ain't gonna lie. They got some new ones, huh? Yeah, they do. I ain't gonna lie. They do. Hey, but I ain't gonna lie, y'all. We have to leave Chance because Chance ain't had nothing for my baby. They ain't had nothing for my baby in there, so we gotta shoot the well, full out the kids. Yeah, kids full out the. I would have got my. I would have got a got a some New Balances. I ain't gonna. <laughs> I ain't, oh, yeah, nah, the, them can, New Balances was you hard. Can, you can drip the New Balances. You're right, hard. but kids full out could probably got more options. You yeah, feel me? Because those those was the only ones I seen for. Her. Hopefully, nigga, we gotta go all the way down the other damn way. <laughs> but no, but it's by where we parked our cars We're at really though. Working. Oh yeah, I'm good. Where we parked that? Yeah. Right down the front. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Mark got me out the crib, y'all, man. He got me out the house today. I got my chop. I was I'm about to shoot back to the crib. Man, what? I, mean, what? Yeah, we, I know you smell like loud, wow, nigga. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> hey, but look, y'all, man. I'm about to tune in so I can find baby Kenzie some shoes and stuff, y'all, man. We gonna tune back in. I had to stop at the gallery to get baby Kenzie some shoes and stuff. I'm gonna surprise her with it next time I see her, which is probably gonna be tomorrow, most likely. But look, man, like I told y'all, Mark got me out at the crib going to the webster hey bro when you're outside with a mark just be ready to spend some money just be ready bro just be ready to spend some bread so we about to just see what oh it smell good in here mmm amar it smell good up in here this is this is what my i want my my female house to smell like when i walk up in here y'all hey y'all look so Mark about to cut these hey let me see them twin so what you think about putting together with them <laughs> you lost for real. I don't know who is. Hey. Oh. But after this, bro, we about to go get some food, man, because I am hungry. I'm really hungry for real, man. But I got my baby something, man, so I feel good. I just want to go go see her right now, give her a big old hug and just be around her. But, you know, outside, get the shit done right now. Nigga, bad. Everybody go get your ass about them. What you say? <laughs> hey, but, hey, on some, on some risk, you though? I, it's crazy because I can see you with these though, Twin. And depending on how you rock it off, with some all black, it depends on like what your black fit be. But he think about it. He think about it. I cannot wear this shit for <laughs> shorts, bro. Like right now, I'm a, I don't know, I look crazy. You look crazy. 
Yeah, yeah. Yeah, now with your fit now. Hell no. You probably have to go like all black or something. Hey, bro, you funny as fuck. <laughs> Damn. Hey, y'all, look at my baby right here, man. Hey, bro, I'm telling y'all, just stay tuned, bro. My baby gonna look completely different. Gonna sound different, all type of stuff, man. Y'all see, bro. Ain't gonna lie, y'all, man. Y'all see, bro, hood? Like I was telling y'all before, man. Omar got a see-through hood, bro. Like Omar know what he doing when it come to his car shit, bro. And his shit fast. And it's BMW. And since it's BMW, you know the technology on it is stupid crazy. But, but y'all, bro, we about to go get some food. We about to go be good. Cause you know, nigga, I've been hungry all day, y'all. So when we get there, I'ma tune back in. Omar, you feel me? He just he just went into Webster. Hey, how you feeling, man? This nigga got me out the house today, y'all. Wow, the whole gang is in Atlanta. All right, y'all. Y'all see, man, we posted, bro. We coming to Sea Wheel spot. Uchi. This is my first time coming here. This is really a Mars spot, man. He really about to put me on. So I'm about to, I'm about to, about to message me, like, we got to come in. Yeah, man. We about to see what this food hitting for, y'all. So hopefully it's banging because your boy's starving. Go to the bar. Yeah, yeah, to the bar? Yeah, yeah. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Omar thought, uh, Omar thought the Valley dude was revving his car, bro. He was about to get on their ass mm -hmm. and some bullshit, shit, bro. This shit crazy. For real, y'all. Nigga was revving his shit, bro. But yeah, man. Hey, today's a good day, man. We went to the mall, got Kenzie some stuff. Uh, really ran a few errands. I gotta see what I'm gonna do this weekend, bro. Like I said, bro, the whole gang is gone, bro. I miss my niggas already, bro. I miss my niggas already. But we about to go in here. We about to get some good food and everything, y'all. I'm probably gonna show y'all. If the music not playing too loud, bro, I'm gonna yeah, show y'all. Yeah, yeah, man. He said our car is parked over there. Yeah, he said our car is parked over there, twin. Uh, I don't, I don't know if we can see. I don't know. They probably put it like in the garage or something. I don't know, for real, for real. But shit, I don't know. Hey, hey, y'all, look, bro. Look where Mark got me at, bro. We about to cook our own steak, bro. Don't play. You feel me? Hey. This shit look good, don't it, though? Hey, Amar, I'm, I'm, I'm fucking with the vibes, man. I ain't gonna lie. I'm, I'm, I see what type of vibes you be on. Yeah, something different. Yeah, something different. I ain't gonna lie. We're gonna do it with the chopsticks. Ooh, okay. My brother, I ain't gonna lie. I think we in Japan right now. I feel yeah, it. Hold on. Hold on. I, I, I didn't make sure I was doing that. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Hey, but, but man, y'all, we about to cook our own steak. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. This is my first time coming to a place like this. I love the vibes. The vibes here is immaculate. Good vibes, good vibes. I gotta get that boomerang for the ground. Gotta get that boomerang. Gotta get it right. You gotta get it right. Oh, yeah. Yeah, twin, you know, I'm cooking my steak fresh off a fucking leaf. Leaf. Off the leaf, y'all. Y'all see, we get busy. We get, it get down. You gotta get it right. we cooking our own. Hey, nigga, that shit popping. Right. Nigga, that shit popping. Yeah. Hey, bro, Amar popping his food on me right now, but. So we gonna let right, that go. Hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. We cooking our own food right now, bro. That's the type of time we on. <laughs> Look at him. He trying to do something. Nah, leave that to the chefs. Leave that to the chefs, brother. But y'all, bro, Amar got me in here, man. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. I'm messing with the vibes, bro. We cooking our own food right now. Hey, yo, hey, bro. You know she said don't leave it on there for more than ten seconds. I yeah. Don't mind to be cooked a little oh, bit cook. Okay, okay. I'm, I, I'm yeah, rocking whatever you rocking with, man. I ain't gonna lie. Y'all, this is what I got. My bad. I started digging in. I'm so hungry. Y'all see, bro? He dug it in his shit. You still got two pieces left, Tori. Bet y'all, man. Yeah, man. Mark got me out my body, uh, out my uh, comfort zone today. We on some different shit, some Japanese food type shit, y'all. So, man, y'all see the vibe. But we gonna turn in when we get back to the house. Man, I just got home and look who here. Who, who ready for me to get home? Bro, I told Jazz I'm damn near his second owner, bro, for real. But, bro, but, bro, y'all, today was really like a chill day, man. I wasn't even expecting to get out the house, go to the mall, go eat at a nice restaurant like that with Amar, bro. But he got me outside. So whenever you with Amar, man, just expect to go to unexpected places and to spend some money. You feel me? But, yeah, man, that's really it, bro. Um, Man, I feel good, bro. Like I said, bro, today was just like a really like a chill day. Like, I just brought y'all with me today, y'all. You know, I stopped at the mall, got baby Kenzie some stuff. I know I'm going to give her her shoes probably tomorrow or whenever I see her. I think I am going to go see her tomorrow, so I'll probably give her her shoes then. But, yeah, man, that really that really wraps up the vlog, man. Today was really just, what, what's today, Friday? Yeah, today was Friday, man. So, today was really just one of the days in the life, man. I want to go get a haircut. Had to run a couple errands, linked up with Amar and all that good stuff. But... Let me know in the comment section down below what type of bangers, what type of videos y'all you guys want to see. You know I'm gonna get that done for you. But and if you're not part of that family, bro, I'm gonna need you to hit that subscribe button. Follow me on all social media gang. Can we out? Can't even know, but they ain't rhyme for me. I ain't even got lock and they keep trying to clone. If it ain't about racks, all that postpone. And it's crazy, I see it, I'm good on my lonely. And it's crazy, I see it, I'm good on my lonely.